Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is your friend Shinobi, and today's video we are going to check out iOS 17, specifically on the second gen iPhone SE. So I upgraded it after WWDC, and yeah, I am using it on my iPhone SE for the past week or so. But in this video, we're gonna specifically show you how to install it on your iPhone because this time the process is a little bit different. So without any further ado, let's get started. Now, the first thing that you need to do in order to get iOS 17 developer beta on your iPhone SE is to download the Apple developer application from the App Store. Because this time beta profiles are not gonna work, they have been stopped by Apple. This time you have to enroll as a developer basically in the developer app to gain access to the developer betas. So, download the Apple developer application on your iPhone, then open it, sign in with your Apple ID and scroll down once you have signed in and you'll find an enroll now button just tap on it and follow all the steps that will be shown on the screen fill out all the information complete everything and at the end it will tell you to pay a nominal fee to like get the developer access but you can just skip it so once you complete all the information and you get to the payment page where it asks you to make the payment then just close the app that you have enrolled in the developer beta program you just need to go into the settings of your iPhone then go to general then go to software updates and in there you will find a beta update section just open it up and select iOS 17 developer beta so if you do not see iOS 17 developer beta option present in there just restart your phone once and you will see it so select that and then just go back and refresh and yeah you will see the ios 17 developer beta update there for your iphone so just go ahead install it it's a big update it's around six gigabytes so yeah once you update it just have fun with it so the new features that i really like is like standby then there are a few lock screen effects which are there in the new lock screen and now you can resize the font on the lock screen and there are like live activities and live widgets which are there like live interactive widgets which is pretty cool and there's a new wallpaper obviously and a few more things so we'll go into detail about that later on in another video but right now this was everything that you need to install ios 17 on your iphone se so if this video was helpful then make sure to hit the like button and definitely subscribe to the channel for more videos like this also press the notification bell to stay notified about my new uploads so yeah that's about it for this video i'm your friend shinobi and i'm signing out peace